Hey Scorpios, welcome to your reading. You guys are spoiled, you already had one uh, released today, but it was um, the last of the other bunch. So I am doing you guys another. That was a long video, right? Um, very draining. If you're new, welcome. I <laughs> hope you know what we're talking about. Um, but yeah, I thought I would do a quick uh, read for everybody. So I'm not going to forget you guys just because you had one released today. Welcome back, my lovely loyal subscribers. I am running a competition in the community section for a £200 gift card. So if you're subscribed, go and check out the channel and the community section. You'll find the information at the top. And as always, I leave information regarding uh, what decks of cards I use and how to contact me for personal readings and other services in the description box. Okay, guys, so let's begin. Um, free yourself. <laughs> Release me. Um, attraction reversed. <laughs> and let your friends help you here. I'm going to pull some more for you guys. Yep. New love and heart to heart conversations. Somebody wants to... Uh, be with you here. You are attracting somebody in without trying. Um, but I think you might be thinking, I want more friendships rather than um, lovers. But you are getting love offers at this time, Scorpio. Um, always happens, right? New and old will be coming in here to have these heart-to-heart -heart conversations. I feel like you want your freedom. Um because of that attraction card reversed there. We'll see what's going on, Scorpio, but you do have a, this love offer coming your way. Don't shoot the messenger. It's your fault. They love you, not me. <laughs> Let's see here what we have. And hey, Fiona, I know you asked me to keep doing these lives and that, but it's different timing, isn't it? I'm in Paris at the moment. Usually I'm in England. Um... And most of you guys are from America, so yeah, it's getting the timing right to do the Q&A. So I do see your um, comments, but I'll get around to it soon. You guys have to let me know the best time to catch you guys. Okay, um, two of wands and three of cups. So there is some people who are deciding, yes, I want to be in this relationship. There is um, people accepting this offer. This is good news coming your way. The transitionings that we're going through right now are going to be a lot easier on us, Scorpio. So we do receive these blessings, <clears throat> these three of cups. It's time, okay, for these fun times, happy times. Um, enjoy the watery energy. There are changes coming, but they are for the better here. The star and the six of swords now. Um, it's saying... Um, you know, you're moving forward, you're moving out of these difficult times and look at this. These are good cards for us Scorpios, right? You're moving towards what is meant to be. Um, and that's in love. I, Scorpios fall in love like so early in life and meet their soulmates really early in life. Um, so don't be surprised when you have multiple, right? When we go through these lessons, these changes, if we're not growing together, we're growing apart. So you're moving towards what's destined for you here. Um, but it's good. It's good. Trust this watery energy. Um, leave behind all that bumpy water and all that turbulence. Move towards what's meant for you here. Major healing with the star. Judgment, two of pentacles. And that two of cups. <laughs> you're moving towards a soulmate who you're destined to be with. It's time now with judgment. Um, there has been delays and feeling like you've been stuck still in love and things like that. You either go through uh, situations where you're in love and you're in long term relationships with long term commitments here or, you know, a long time in separation, single. So I feel it's time now. Two of Pentacles is like a contract. So it's time now for you to be in this long-term relationship. This may be um, the relationship that's, you know, last your lifetime here. It's time. And I'm glad it's more light-hearted. That's what I wanted for a Scorpio, to do something lighter than the longer reads that go a little bit deeper. Because of this, 
seven of wands chariot and the empress you know attracting what you deserve you've been in the karmic trenches now you deserve this success this abundance this love um this is venus coming your way um fate you know helping this chariot get to this star to where you're meant to be along with this judgment look at these major arcana here that are coming out you're getting a lot of help from behind the scenes it's been challenging no doubt it's been challenging um but it's made you so much stronger. Look at that. Look at this. You can stand alone. They're all stood together, but you're alone and you're still stronger than they are. So <laughs> what doesn't kill you makes you stronger, right, Scorpio? So don't hate these challenges or experiences you've been through in life because they're leading you towards this. Your blessings your love, your freedom away from those challenging times, those challenging people, it's leading you all to this success, abundance, love. Who you are meant to be with, that's the person who is being attracted into your life here. Not chasing, attracting, okay? Not chasing, attracting with this Empress energy. I'm so glad the Empress keeps coming out now and we're no longer... Um, that chasing energy or trying to please people, please, it won't work, okay? The universe will just keep sending things away. Um, so now we have this abundance coming in for you guys. We have who you're meant to be with. Again, I picked up an extra card. Um, the sun came with the Queen of Cups. So with the sun in Cancer, your ships are coming in. You will learn new lessons. You will get new information brought to you via your intuition. But because you've healed those cycles, those lessons, um, been through those challenges, you're equipped to handle anything that comes your way. So look at this sun. It's bringing this positive energy for you in cancer season. It's better than the airy energy of Gemini season and Aquarius season where you probably felt really detached from people. Um, you're now ready for these sorts of people in your life, this three of cups, this Three of Wands, this good news, this celebration, communication, uh, joining together with people. After you freed yourself from whatever it is you needed to free yourself from, you may have even had closure with these heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Um, you may have waited for closure and found your own within yourself because the page is about seeking information, um, gaining information. This is why we call it the spying page. So you may have um, gained this information now and received your closure. So you're moving on with the sun. This is a yes. Yes, embrace these changes because this is where you're meant to be. So enjoy it, Scorpio. Embrace it. And anything that, you know, was created challenges in your life, let go for now. Free yourself from that and enjoy all the benefits of the sun being in cancer. Good luck, guys.